to Domingo. We'll talk it over. Mano a mano. Okay, that's... A new one? Didn't expect a gig to pop out. <clears throat> running around the night city <coughs> doing nothing significant really that car is still floating which is nice Daniels, I'm supposed to help you with this gig. What was that all about? One of his men dropped out after weeks of prep. And me, I'm thinking that's a problem that could bite us in the ass. Daniels disagrees. Uh, anyways, you remember the guy, right? Yeah. Pig who picked up a ride when I dropped by your chop shop. My garage. But yeah, that's him. Anyway, listen up. You're going to Corporal Plaza, Arasaka Docks. You want to swipe us a truck hauling med equipment. Your backup? Daniels and his buddies from the NCPD. They'll be incognito, dressed as workers. You head on over. Daniels will be in touch. Huh. Shit, not a single Your Majesty. Keeps going like this, El Clowno might even get a haircut. Clipping a truck off Arasaka's docks is a big ask. Any tips? Mm, better go at night. Security will be lower. Daniels will give you more deeds. Great. That all? Hmm. If we pull it off, the kids in San Domo won't have to go through what I did. Anyway, we need a smoke. Go on, give a chum some space. Right. Where have I heard that one before? They all say they want space, but what they really want to hear is, Muammar, is everything okay? I gotta be your fucking empathy coach now, too? Chum clearly wants to talk about it, just can't say so. I'm okay, I guess. <laughs> Muammar, something wrong? Acting weirdly, uh, composed. Ah, uh, El Capitan, the Joker needs a fucking break. He'll be back. You know I grew up here. Me and Daniels. Santo fucking Domingo. You know what we were most scared of as kids? Guessing it wasn't monsters under the bed. Hmm. Unfortunately, no. Biggest fear was a glass of water. You see, the filter sometimes gonked out. Any sip could be your last. Talking cancer, arthritis, kids with the joints of 70-year-olds. All in a fucking glass of water. In these homes, every damn day, years on end. Shit. This is Sokka's doing. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. been pumping poison into the groundwater here since 2061. Of course, we didn't know how bad it was for a good long while. As I fucking thought. Shit. How bad was it? <laughs> was. Still is. Everyone here has lost someone. Every kid's battling some disease or disorder. Guessing me and Daniels won't live to a ripe old age either. Could breach Saka's data forts, find the person responsible. You know, whoever covered up the leaks. Already did. Name's Maria Sparks. Looked her right in the eye, thought about what to do for a long while. You know their employees drank the water. They didn't tell them either. Arasaka wanted the data buried. No surprise. So what'd you do? Recruited her. Thanks to her, we know about the transport. I mean, I'm a fixer, ain't I? Make contacts. Get things done. So this med equipment, it's gonna help the sick, right? Should ease some of their suffering, yeah. But the most important thing is peeps will see someone still gives half a shit. Maybe they'll feel something besides fear for a change. Stealing for the greater good. The system, man, is all kinds of fucked up, V. Anyway, get going. And don't let us down. I won't. What a sucker! <laughs> Well, I'm on the Oh, that's one big ass gig for the end game. I solved all the crimes, did all the quests and gigs, gathered almost everything. And did not expect another big quest. Mission, whatever. That's cool. So you can find the port. Great. Way to go, Merc. You remember what's next? Mm. 
Look, get that you're stressed, but I need you to keep it professional. Quit looking for reasons to fight. And you quit your psychobabble bullshit. Now listen, watch for security. Find the behemoth truck with the Arasaka logo. You got a visual? Hope you can handle it. Once you're behind the wheel, we'll jam their comms. Should give you time to roll before they call backup. Remember, the gear comes first. Don't damage it. Don't fuck around. Do use your damn head. Now move. I'll be on the line. Well, he's not very... <clears throat> uh, decent. Death to what a sucker. actually was here from time I think I came here twice and killed them all Well, that's a kind of a, a dumb assumption. Ugh! <sighs> 
No, 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 no. Twenty fucking devices. What the hell? I should check where the auto save was. Oh! Okay. I'm not far away then? Okay. No, it's four devices instead of twenty. Okay then. Makes sense.
Got the truck. I didn't even see. Got the truck. Quick, don't drive. Hold that. Jacob too. The hell are you walking at? Why the fuck are you still here? Here to help you out. Me? Who gives a shit about me? The gear's there. They blocked the streets by now. Fuck, go! Well, I saved him because of uh, Muammar. What about Daniels? What the hell? What the hell? So, did that bug out now? What the hell?
Не, дышит бак, да? Your Majesty. Talk about a close one. There we are. Mickey, check the gear, dump the truck. <laughs> what about Daniels? He contact you? Yeah, he's alive, all right, and pissed. We lost some gear because of that blockade. Couldn't just leave the guy there. Mm, you could have, but you didn't. I get it. Daniels lives, some gear dies. Not everyone gets help. Choices, V. Being a little unfair there, Captain. That's life in Santo Domingo. Anyway, relax. Tossing you a real prim whip. Got some bubbly next to it, too. Cheers to you, V. Thanks, El Capitan. Take care. Interesting, to say the least. Let's see how fast can this go. 
Autsch. Yeah, we'll just assume 150. No, 160. Okay. It's not as fast as the that expensive one. But Five. Okay. The fastest one that is two ten. It's more like hundred and eighty on a flat road. Yeah, okay. 